A report has just been published and it's stating Hunmin Son is among eight Tottenham Hotspur players and staff hit by COVID-19. Three more positives expected today. Welcome back to the channel, hope you're all keeping well. So further to last night's video, the breaking news about Tottenham Hotspur being hit by the COVID-19 outbreak. A report has been published by the Football Insider today and it states Hunmin Son is among six Tottenham stars hit by the COVID outbreak that has placed the team's fixtures under potential threat. In the report, it says Emerson Royale and Brian Hill missed Tottenham's 3-0 win over Norwich City after testing positive for COVID-19. A Tottenham source has told the Football Insider that Hunmin Son, Lucas Moura, Ben Davis, and the injured central defender Christian Romero have also tested positive for coronavirus this week. It then states, in addition to the six Tottenham Hotspur players, coaches Ryan Mason and Christian Stellini have also been hit by the outbreak that has rocked the camp. The source added that further mass testing is due to take place at Tottenham Hotspur today, the 7th of December, and up to three more positives are expected by the club. Those who have tested positive must self-isolate for 10 days under government guidelines, likely ruling them out of Tottenham's next three matches. The only potential saviour for Tottenham is if the six players test negative after a further round of testing taking place today. The club did have two players earlier in this season recording false positive tests and then negatives on two follow-up tests. Tottenham Hotspur head coach Antonio Conte is now facing the prospect of fielding a severely weakened team for the club's upcoming fixtures. Tottenham are scheduled to play Wren on Thursday in a must-win final group stage game in the Europa Conference League. And then Spurs travel to the Amex Stadium on Sunday to play Brighton, which is followed by Premier League fixtures next week against Leicester and Liverpool. Premier League fixtures have previously been postponed due to COVID outbreaks, but this won't happen in the Europa Conference League because Tottenham currently have enough players to field a team. In a report published today by the Guardian newspaper, it states that Tottenham's matches against Aston Villa and Fulham were called off last season due to COVID-19, while two players posted false positive results on a lateral flow test earlier in this campaign, but then they were later cleared to play by a negative PCR test. Antonio Conte will be hoping something similar happens again and there will be no more positive tests before a crunch period. Then in the Guardian report, it says calling off the Wren game appears highly unlikely. According to UEFA rules, a team need to have fewer than 13 available players or no registered goalkeeper available for that to be the case. If the situation does get worse, the club could consider asking the Premier League to call off the Brighton game on Sunday. The league works on a case-by-case -case basis, and if a club was to request a game to be postponed, it would be a Premier League bald decision. Spurs have so far not commented on the situation. In a report today from the BBC, they are stating that more PCR testing is due to take place over the next 24 hours. And then they go on to say it is yet to be established whether the club will contact the Premier League about Sunday's game at the Amex Stadium against Brighton. But a decision to postpone league matches can only be made by the competition board. Thanks for watching today's video. If you don't subscribe to this channel as yet, please do hit that subscribe button. As soon as any more news is released, it will be out on this channel. And uh, I will see you on the next video. Until then, come on you Spurs.